Hi and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great October. Um, I live in an area where there's a lot of farms and open fields and everything like that. So oftentimes in the morning, I'll be driving around doing the errands, stuff that moms need to do. And there will be these gorgeous fields of fog surrounding me. And because of that, I was inspired to come up with this really quick and really easy way to make uh, fog bits for your terrain and your tabletop games. The supplies you need are actually pretty easy and you may even have them already in your house. And if not, they're very easy to get a hold of. The first thing you want is something called polyfill. Now this is something you can get at any craft or fabric store. And if for some reason you don't have one of those nearby you, this is something you can also go out and get if you buy a cheap pillow from Walmart or a similar type of store, because basically it's the stuffing inside pillows. So you want to have some of that on hand. The other thing you're going to need are beer bottle or soda bottle caps. Now, if you don't have any of these around your house, you can also use things like washers or lower denomination coins. The point is you want something to have a little bit of heft to it because I found out that using plastic water bottle caps or pieces of, you know, scrap foam, it didn't work out so well. These things literally floated off the table because it was too light. So you need something with a little, little bit of heft to it to make it work. The last thing you're gonna want is your low temp hot glue gun because you just wanna be careful the polyfill is a thinner threading. You don't wanna overpower it with a hot, hot glue gun. Uh, otherwise you might start melting things. So the process itself is very easy and I'm gonna put the little video in with this so you can see it as I go along here. Really all you need to do is you're gonna tear off a piece of the batting and you wanna spread it out a little bit. Now the thing about batting is it tends to be in a sheet-like quality. So you take that sheet, you sort of fold it in the middle, and then you're gonna put some hot glue in the middle of your bottle cap, and you're gonna take the folded over piece of batting and you're going to stick it into the cap. And once the glue has cooled enough, you can put the cap on the table that you're working on, and then you start pulling the batting apart little by little, fluffing it out to get into shapes that you want. Now you may find as you're fluffing it out that you might have these strands that sort of pull off in a way. That's very easy to fix. Just take your glue gun, pull back the batting that's already in the bottle cap, put a thin thread of hot glue against that bottle cap and the previous batting and just bring that straight piece back around and attach it. So keep fluffing it out until it gets the shape and the form that you're looking for, even size. That's why I was doing it on the map so I can, not the map, the mat. So you can do it on the mat so you can see the size that you're working with and how big it's gonna be. Uh, once you get it to the size and shape that you want, to finish it off, it's super easy. Take that sucker outside with the rest of them and just spray it down with a layer of protective coating. I used a Krylon acrylic spray uh, just as a nice little seal for it and it helps it hold its foam. And as you can see right here, it's very durable. And it's one of those things, if it gets a little flat, you can fluff it out a little bit again, but putting on the coat definitely helps it stay a little better. And again, it's just a basic cap at the bottom. You can opt to paint these if you want. Uh, you could do white, you could do gray, whatever you want to do. Uh, other things you can do with this to make this a little bit more fun is you can take uh, different color spray paints to give it different hues. You can take the ones that sort of have those metallic flecks of glitter in that to make it shiny, to make it look like some sort of magic effect. I do have some other things coming up soon. Just need a little bit more time to work on them. But as always, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little tip here and uh, have some fun with it. Any questions, you can always reach out to me. I'm more than happy to help you out. Have a great day, whatever it is you're doing, and I will see you later. Bye. Is you're gonna take rain, fog, is bad. I'm doing a thing about fog and I just totally forgot what I was gonna say. You are a teetotaler and you don't drink beer from a bottle. Uh, you can use other things like metal wa washers. Walshers. Walshers. Applies. And don't do it. Oi! Oi! Come here. Take, I don't know how many.